We are at sea uh, and we are approaching the dock. The biggest challenge a day like this is the wind. The boat will immediately drift away. So you always need to be a step ahead. Uh, you need to think through what will happen before you get there. Now we will give you some tips on what to think about when docking a boat in windy conditions. First thing would be to find out from where does the wind come. And if you can, try to find a dock spot where you can dock with the front of the boat towards the wind. That makes life much easier. Second thing, when you are approaching your dock spot, aim towards the wind. So aim for a spot towards the wind from where you want to end up. Because the wind will take you from that spot. So then you will end up where you actually want the boat to go. Third thing, go slow. It's no stress and by planning, by thinking ahead, you can avoid a lot of that stress. Don't go fast and be safe. It's better to do it again if you miss. So now we are approaching the dock. We are having the wind from the front. We need to aim towards the wind in order to not drift back. We need to find a good mooring spot to put on the first mooring and you want that mooring to be, if we have the wind from the front, we want it to be in the front of the boat. Otherwise, the boat would spin around if you put on the aft mooring first. We want to end up with the, uh, uh, that ladder where we have the door. Uh, so with the first mooring would be uh, somewhere between the ladders on the dock spot here. And then we aim towards the wind, so a little bit further ahead than that mooring is. Because the wind will take us backwards. Being a couple of steps ahead is taking the stress down a lot. Because if you end up in a situation where the boats suddenly start to do things that you didn't plan for, the situation can quickly get very stressful. So do plan ahead. Next. So now we have seen how to dock a boat with the traditional docking using steering wheel and control levers. Now we'll show you how to dock a boat with assisted docking. Assisted docking lets you take a pause at any time to think through the next step. So you don't need to be that step ahead because the system will take care of that for you. With assisted docking the system will help you to uh, overcome the problem with wind and current. So when you're going in straight lines the system will counteract the wind and the current and let the boat do what you intended to do. This function is really helpful in the harsh conditions that we have today because it will support you from drifting to the sides. It will move you perfectly forward or perfectly sideways. And then finally you have the fine tuning part which puts you exactly where you want to be with a very high accuracy. Also in this harsh condition.